back to The Sims 4 Cats and Dogs. So our girl just got home from work and we made like 500 and some odd simoleons and Brayden actually called us before work and we couldn't hang out with him because we were obviously heading to work or about to head to work. So I thought maybe we could go over and visit him and see how things are going and see if our little puppy Peanut is pregnant because I am so freaking curious and I'm noticing this has a bunch of stuff. Ooh, let's go harvest it. Let's go see what we can do here. Maybe this will make us a little bit of money. I'm not sure how much money these will be worth, but let's take a look. Um, oh, 17. Oh my God, 408 simoleons for those. Holy crud. Okay, we're gonna sell these. Uh, I'm gonna hold on to them just in case like there is a reason that I need to but 408 simoleons that is a pretty freaking penny. Oh my goodness. So what do we have back here? Just bushes of catnip and daisies. So nothing too exciting. So what I'm gonna do is have her... How are our pets doing? You need to play and you're going to actually so we're not gonna worry about that. And Maya needs some food, so why don't you come down here and eat? Mayor Whiskers needs to use the little litter box, so you need to do that. And Waffle is in a good mood, and Rainbow just needs to play. And this is so adorable, like, I can't even deal with this. Let me see if I can get a picture, because that's the kind of person I am. I always have to get pictures. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, we, we did this all wrong. Oh my god. Let me try again. Sorry, guys. I'm still a noob at using these buttons here to take pictures, so. Okay, there we go. We got a picture. All right, so we're going to have her kind of head off, and hopefully he will complain about bladder. Okay, go use the bathroom, silly. It's right upstairs. Oh, go use the potty. It's self-cleaning, so yeah, see, we don't have to... Empty litter storage. I wonder if we actually do have to do something with that. Uh, but what I'm going to do is have her travel. Or should we call him over? No, we're going to go to his house because I want to see if Peanut is there. So we're going to... Oh, wait. I'm just traveling alone. Duh. Oh my gosh. I tell you. So we'll see if Peanut is pregnant. And I really kind of hope that she is because I can only imagine puppies between the two of them would be so adorable. So I'm kind of excited to see if she is or if she's had babies because, well, it doesn't look like it. Is he not home? I don't think he's home because it's kind of like blurred out. You guys see that? Well, maybe we can invite him to come over to his own house. Uh, but... I really can't believe how quickly, um, what's her name? Maya had the kitten, so I assume the dogs would be the same way. I don't know, but I really want to see puppies because I have not seen puppies in this game. Like, I haven't played with an actual puppy in this game, and I'm really freaking excited to see. Oh, he is here. Okay, that was just really strange looking. So let's go ahead and brighten his day see how he's doing um and we're gonna come in here and kind of peek around and see oh peanut you need a bath you are gross can we give you a bath um i just saw it and i x'd out of it where give bath we're gonna give a bath we're not gonna brush we're gonna give you a bath because that's what you need brayden take care of your dog you dummy what are we chatting about we're just chatting away. Okay. He's so cute, though. And I can't even believe that uh, that they have such, like, romance and everything. But, you know, we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. Oh, are we going to give you a bath? Are you going to let us? <gasps> oh. Our poor little baby is so stinky. I think we need to give um, Bomber a bath as well. I'm pretty sure he was stinky. Look at Look at the smell coming from him. Oh my gosh. I hope that we have... Does he have a tub anywhere in here? He does. Oh my god. His house is so huge. Like, we need to, like, lock him in. Seriously? Like, what is she even thinking? He has so much. Like, look at this house. One, two, three, four. This could be a bedroom. So, five bedrooms right? Is there one downstairs too? Yeah, this is a five-bedroom house. Like, 
and he he totally is into her so hopefully she will kind of you know come out of her little oh my gosh claire (laughs) hopefully she'll come out of her little bubble and not be so scared of relationships because i think brayden is really really into her and really wants to just take care of her like i feel like maybe he has some money and you know he just wants to take care of her and her pets, obviously, and help her, you know, with her career where she can quit her job and do what she actually loves and spend all of her time, you know, at the clinic and stuff like that. So we'll have to see. Uh, but this says, what have they done to you? It's not your fault. Oh, no, the puppy has you stinky. Did you get sprayed? I wonder if he got sprayed by uh, or she got sprayed by a uh, what you call it? Uh, pet calmingly. Oh, I think that she might have gotten sprayed or something because that's the only reason I can assume why it says smelly like that. So, a skunk. I was trying to think. I'm like, what the heck is that animal's name? Gosh, what is wrong with me? Okay, where is Mr. Braden at? Maybe we'll come kind of talk to him and see. Oh. Oh, she's already going to talk to him. Okay. I mean, maybe she's gonna, maybe she'll open herself up a little bit, you know? We'll see how it goes. I think he would be very good for her. He seems to be like he's got his life together. You know, I mean, he has a huge house. He's, I think he has a job. I am not sure. But his parents did leave him this house. So, oh, he doesn't. He's unemployed. But maybe he maybe he has enough money that he doesn't have to work. So, I mean, okay, he could help us out at the clinic, you know. Uh, let's see here. What can we do? Why does she want to help all of these bad relationships? It is so funny to me. Okay, let's get uh, let's get a little bit friendly. Um, let's have to give him a stargaze. That would be cute. I don't know, you guys. Maybe she'll maybe she'll start to open up a little bit. Maybe I think she's kind of scared because she does have feelings for him, and she's had such horrible luck. So she's probably thinking, "Oh my God, am I really gonna let myself get into this again?" Like, is she really going to do it? Look how cute they look. (laughs) They're so adorable. I don't know. You guys are going to have to let me know in the comments down below. Do you think we should, you think we should have her give it a shot? I mean, what do you think? What do you think? Let's go ahead and, uh, let's go ahead and embrace him. Let's just get a little romantic and see, see where it takes them. Oh yeah. He's into it. He's so into it. Um, let's see what else. What else are you doing? You're just kind of chatting with him. And let's do a pickup line. And let's do, should we do a little woohoo? Should we? Maybe we should. Maybe we should do a little woohoo. And then she's probably going to be like, oh my god, let's just do it. Let's just do it. Let's go ahead and offer him a rose. And come back here. Where are you guys going? And then let's just do a little woohoo and see see what happens and be like, oh, oh well. <laughs> Too bad there isn't a risky woohoo. Okay, what are you guys doing? You're just chatting? Maybe they just want to chat. I don't know. This is what are they doing? Oh, okay. I'm like, what in the world are they doing? Are they losing their damn mind? Okay. So it doesn't seem like peanut. I don't know if Peanut is pregnant or not. Like, I, it's really hard to tell. I don't know how we can tell. And I don't even know where Peanut went to see if maybe MC Command will show it. Because I don't know. I'm not sure. I can't believe how, like, tall these rooms are, too. These, this house is just so nice. <gasps> oh, dang, girl. What are you getting yourself into? What are you getting yourself into? I don't know. I really think that she's, I think, I think she's, uh, um, kind of gonna let her guard down and open, open up a little bit to him because, I mean, he's such a nice person. They became friends very quickly. Peanut, let's see, can we do, okay, uh, spouse none. Okay, well, I guess it says current children. Obviously, we don't have any yet, but maybe, I don't know. All right, so she's gonna kind of, sneak out. He he kind of offered for her to stay the night, but I think she's going to sneak out and head back home because she's sitting here like, look at her. She's first of all got some sort of crap all over her because she's sick. So I think she's going to maybe sneak out and just head home and be like, what in the world? But do you see her? Like, I think she's, oh, that was 
disgusting. <laughs> Absolutely disgusting. Okay, he woohooed with you when you got all that crap on you and you just like snotted all over the place. Girl, he must really like you. <laughs> oh my god. So I'm gonna go ahead and send her on home and what are you gonna do? Oh my god. You guys, I think, I really think that she is into him and I think she's just gonna, she's gonna give it a go. What do you guys think? I think we should give it a go. It might, it might be good. It might be bad. We'll have to see. Oh my God. Oh, and now she's going to return home, I think. So what I'm going to do is just have her head home and go to sleep. And let me see, does she work tomorrow? She does work tomorrow, so I'll probably pick up again whenever she is off of work. So I'll see you guys. Right, guys. So we are back, and she is still feeling pretty sick. She's not feeling good at all. So I'm gonna have her order some medicine, and also we got another little call from Brayden, and this time he said, "You guys," he said, "I've been thinking about you. I want to go on a date," and of course we couldn't go again because we were literally walking out the door to work. And I think we're going to, oh my gosh, I think we're going to invite him over and kind of see what's going on because I think the reason that she would be so willing to kind of, you know, make things official with him and actually open herself up to somebody yet again is because of the way he talks to her, the way he treats her. He isn't like, um, he's not like some sort of douchebag, you know, he, he just like, he's really sweet to her and he even told her, you know, like, it's no rush, but I really do have feelings for you. So I think that's why she is kind of more willing to possibly open herself up to him. And this dude coming around the corner, he looks so mad. Oh, here comes Brayden. Here he comes. So I don't know. I kind of think maybe we should, should we just make it official with them, you guys? I mean, who knows? It might not, it might not work out, but I think we should kind of, kind of give it a shot here. Let's see. Let's go ahead and um, let's go ahead and compliment his appearance and tell him how great he's looking. Uh oh, what is wrong with you, Rainbow? Oh, you gotta go potty. Come in here and go use the litter box. And oh no, all the food is bad. So we're gonna have to do something about that. I wonder, do we need to buy these? Is that the only way the food stays good? Oh, what are you gonna do? Okay, let's go ahead and just be super romantic. Let's go ahead and blow him a kiss and then let's just ask him to be our boyfriend. We'll be like, you know what? We're gonna, we're gonna give it a shot. You have to be patient with us, but I really am falling for you. So please don't screw this up. Please don't hurt me the way I've been hurt before. So we'll see how this goes. He's like, yes. Oh, you guys, Arlie is now with Brandon or Brayden. Brandon, oh God. How cute. Okay. Let's see. Let's, uh, let's invite him to stay the night. Tell him he can stay over for the night. And then we're going to kind of clean out these bowls. Can we like do that with all of them? A sleepover sounds great. Oh my God. Uh, let's go ahead and clean empty bowl. Oh, she's going to do that right now with all of them. Never mind. <laughs> what are you guys doing in here? Are you guys like forming some sort of group against me? Okay. I want you to clean this one out too. Empty bowl. Are you going to do that? Okay. I think she is. Then we can refill all of these. Okay. You're okay. Fill all pet bowls. The cat is eating old, nasty food. Bomber, what do you need? You need some affection, you poor little baby. Oh, you're coming over here to talk to Mayor Whiskers. Oh, you're going to nuzzle with Mayor Whiskers. How? Oh, my God, that is so cute. I can't. I can't even deal. Let's go ahead and pet talk. And Maya, how are you doing? You're actually doing good. Waffle needs to go potty. So, oh, it looks like Brayden is going to make himself comfortable and go to sleep right now. I guess he's kind of tired. I mean, it's only 8 p.m., but if that's what he wants to do, that is totally fine. What are you going to do? I still need to figure out how we can upgrade this, like what we need. Oh, handiness. Duh. Oh, my God. Been here. Done that. Okay. I always click on this and I need to stop. Let's get some leftovers because she is a bit hungry. Oh, my foot is asleep because I've been sitting on it again. Um. So, yeah. And she's feeling pretty good from her medication. So, that is good. We don't have to worry about her being sick or anything like that. I cannot believe Brayden went to sleep already. Like, really? Okay. 
Okay, boy. I mean, she's not super tired, but she does need to use the bathroom. I was going to have her sculpt a little bit. So come over here and use. But we kind of need to work on our programming. So why don't you come over here and do that? Because I want to make sure that we can get her job, you know, as many promotions as possible to make as much money as possible because we really want to put all of our money into that vet clinic and we have not been able to and we need to go back there, but we really need to make some money first. Now, Brayden might be a bit of a blessing to us because I don't know how much money he has, so it could be good. He might not have that much money at all. I really don't know. So I don't know if we could find out. <laughs> Can we find out? Like, I don't know how you find out how much money they have, but he could be a blessing. But we're not with him because of the money, okay? that That's not what we're with him for because uh, he's actually a really nice guy and seems to care about her a lot and we need that in our life because we don't have that much luck with men, so... Hopefully he continues to be a good person and he doesn't turn into, you know, total shit like the other people. So, all right. She needs to get her skill up to level five and also do this. So maybe we can get a promotion tomorrow if I have her work on this. So I think what I'm going to do is just kind of have her work until she gets her uh, little skill there. Do we need, what else do we need to do here? We need to feel the love successfully train out of four misbehaviors and be companions with two animals. So we still need to work on that as well. So in the next part, I think what we're going to do is kind of try to work a little bit more on this with our pets, try to train them out of four misbehaviors, which I'm sure we can watch the kittens pretty closely and have misbehaviors, you know, happening, which I don't even know when they're going to age up. So... Like, it doesn't say, so I don't know how they age up or how long they are kittens. So if you guys know, please let me know down in the comments down below. And if you guys think that, you know, if you guys ship Lee and Brayden, please let me know. Maybe he will offer for her to move in eventually with uh, with him to have a much bigger space. Now, I do love this house. Don't get me wrong. I love this house because it is a big house, but it would be so nice to have his huge house because I do want her to eventually have a family and, you know, all of that. And they could have a big family. Like, I could see the two of them having a huge family and just, like, having a very happy life, her having a successful clinic. Like, that's kind of the goal that I would like to have happen. Um, so hopefully it will work out that way for her. So let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Leave a like on this video if you guys are enjoying it. Subscribe before you go if you've not already. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I upload, which is every single day except for Sunday. And as usual, I love you all so very much and I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs>